Evelyn Shop, congratulations, gold medal here in Agadir. How does it feel to win? Uh, first, thank you. It's every time it's great to win, and uh, I'm really happy to to finish first now after the Grand Slam in Düsseldorf, which was really not a good performance for me, and to finish now first. Uh, yeah, it's it's cool. It's, it's good. <laughs> The last time you won a Grand Prix was in 2016. How does it feel to be back on top of the podium again? Yeah, of course, it's it's a good feeling. Uh, the last two years, sometimes it was a little bit difficult. I got the medal at the Europeans, which was quite good and surprised. But uh, to be on the top of a Grand Prix, it's the second medal ever so in the Grand Prix. So it's good. In the final, you had Florian of uh, Romania. You fought her four times before uh, until today, and it was, the score was 2 2. So it's a, a growing rivalry between the two of you. What was going through your mind as you were going out to fight her? Did you have a game plan? I uh, know she's left, and we fought a lot of boundaries also in the training camps. And my goal was just hold the sleeve down <laughs> and don't let her go up in the, in the back and uh, to go out on the tatami to have fun, to find not to. Be con too much concentrated on something and just yeah sleep sleep sleep. <laughs> you won in Osakomi, but the transition to it was uh, quite unusual. Uh, talk us through this moment and how you ended up uh, holding her down. Yeah, it's quite diffi too difficult to explain, but I thought yeah yeah I have to be strong in the in the upper body to control her with the sleeve and the the neck, and she attacked. Seonage or drop Seonage, something like that. I was just a uh, hip in front and <laughs> pull her. And then, yeah, it was possible to, to hold her down in the Osaikomi. Because normally we have quite tough matches with most two, three, four Yuko sometimes. And now to finish after, I don't know, 40 seconds is good for my heart. <laughs> So you've, uh, you've, you're Grand Prix champion, early 2018. Uh, what confidence does this give you for the year and uh, what are your plans for the year? It gives me confidence in general to go a little bit up in the world ranking list, I hope. And, but there's just the beginning, the qualification period starts in two months. So it's a lot of work to do still, but it's a good way, good way to go. Thank you very much. Thank you.